on the future. Uh, I'm just one person, you know, there's everyone's voice matters in that regard. So I'm quite bullish on this, actually. David says, good morning. <laughs> oh, my God, I got five concurrent streamers. I know that Craig is here, and possibly Dan, if he's still here. And then David, welcome. So, David, I was seeing some bearish CVD on, on Bitcoin earlier. So just bear that in mind. <laughs> All right. Um, I have to go very soon, but I've promised that I'm going to chart this 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 new chart. Uh, so let me just quickly find it. Uh, what did I say it was? MA has asked for this one, liquid crypto. Um, so let me just quickly do I'm going to do really quick. Because uh, and if if no one's interested in this, then fine. Hi, Brian. How's it going? Good morning. Plus one. Hi. Nice to see you. Wow. Got a few people. That's amazing. Welcome. Uh, and obviously, if anyone has any like tokens they want me to have a look at, I'm happy to look at it. Just post it in the comments or just on Twitter or whatever. And I'll, and I'll have a look at it. But this one, I'm going to be really quick. And then I have to go. So liquid crypto. No idea what it is. Um, let me just see what the markets are first. Mm. Oh, there they are. Pancakes are on Max, so it's on Max. It's been around since only December, so it's a brand new token, All right? There's like a thousand brand new tokens on a daily basis now, so I think a lot of people have to be careful because I think a lot of them are scams. Just my personal opinion. You know, people are so desperate to make quick money that, anyway. So we literally have no data. <laughs> uh, when did it launch on Max? January the 24th. So it's been around since December. <sighs> Is it on Pancake Swap? Uh, let me try something. Pang. Pancake swap. Let's see. Can we see a chart on pancake swap? January the fourteenth. Uh the other the other the other site that I I look for is Dex Guru. If anyone's used that, let's have a look at Dex Guru. Oh, so Brian has said, nice analysis. Found you when I was looking up travel, TRVL. Not many on YouTube speak about. Well, here I am. <laughs> yeah, thank you. You're welcome. I'm quite passionate about it because I, I really think that fundamentally, it's uh it's a it's potentially a game changer fundamentally not even just on the crypto element so uh i think we stand a chance and i think once trvl once d travel becomes bigger in terms of value it's going to attract a lot of the bigger investors because a lot of the big investors are waiting they don't really mess around with small market cap tokens or projects they're waiting for the projects to become a bit more significant, a bit more recognized, and then they're going to inject capital. So if we get to a certain level, I don't know when it's going to be, potentially 200 million, 500 million, who knows? Like no one really knows, like maybe a billion. Once we get to that level, then I think a lot of these like bigger hedge capital, like venture funds, whatever, uh, they're going to be looking at this very seriously and they're going to be taking a big chunk out of TRVL uh, because then they will begin to imagine the same thing that we're suggesting, which is that we could in the future take on Airbnb. And I think when they'll look at Airbnb and they'll go, okay, Airbnb is a $90 billion market cap. Why not? Why wouldn't they? All right, sorry, that was just another <laughs> idea. So yeah, so we have it here. Let me see if they have more data here. 
Oops, I shouldn't have done that. 10 minute chart, daily chart. I really hate this uh, Dex Guru. So look, the, de the data comes from this, okay? You see that? And I don't know how and where they launched. Um, problem with Dex Guru is that it doesn't give you the volume data, um, which is what I want. Oh, it does. That's new. Amazing. All right, so Oh, there's no, where's my toolbar? Shit. Um, um, yeah, this sucks. Um, this screen is really shit. Huh? That's the best I can do. <laughs> Um, so problem number one is that the point of control, God. oh shit, look at this, <laughs> it's tough. Just refresh it now. I'll be really quick. Sorry, guys. <laughs> no one's really interested in this. Especially since it's not working. All right. Um, all right, there it is. So problem number one, the point in controls in the highs. That's a real problem. Um, so if we go back to this, how low did it get? Let me see what this is saying. There's nothing really to analyze. Like, this is the thing. You've just launched on Next, right? And there's obviously no bullish in in interest in this token, obviously, because if there was, uh, this would start going up all immediately. Yeah. There's obviously no community at the moment. They, they still haven't developed their community and there's no hype around this token at the moment. That's what I'm seeing. So it's basically off the radar. Um, liquid crypto. It's got a big following cr crowd, really big. See, they've announced on Max and they don't really, I mean, they've got a few tweets and stuff. give me a second let me just have a look at their website as well let me just have a like a good feel of this and 15 percent it's not much in in crypto terms it's not much it's got to bear that in mind uh website let's have a look at this The easiest way to buy, sell, swap, and rewards on your digital atom. It's the app. Let's have a look at the app. Connect wallet. Buy, sell. Dots. 
It looks quite interesting. I don't know what it is. It's good to have a look at the team. I don't mind it because it does look okay you know it doesn't it looks nice i don't really know what it is australian based company that aims to deliver a transparent and fair platform for various crypto related projects projects the main distinction we pride ourselves on is making all our products simple to use mm. i just don't know what it is though that's the thing like i'd like to know um it's not very clear I mean, maybe I'm just not smart enough to figure it out, but I just want a clear communication of like it's DeFi, right? But oh, here it is. Hold on. Liquid Plus is a revolutionary DEX. So it's a DEX, all right? Unlike any other. We curate the highest performing and most robust liquid liquidity pools to create a one-stop platform for astute investors. Choose from over 900 individual pools, or if you prefer, use our custom aggregated index baskets to create passive wealth by offering your digital assets as liquidity. With no human or machine intermediaries, your assets are safe as all the transactions are using secure smart contract architecture. Total value locked. 1.183569 million dollars it's all right huh? it's a dex that's good huh i think it's good yeah all right see you craig nice one he has to go so i think it's a dex so yeah why not more we need dexes more dexes let's go so I think it's just, it's quite a new DEX and it's obviously very specu speculative. Um, it it launched at a very low price, like a really low price. Um, what's the market cap? At the moment, the market cap is $6 million and the volume of trading is quite high, huh? like 300,000 it's quite good, good got, got quite good volume yeah but it's always had pretty good volume huh? I just think it's an accumulation like it's a brand new DEX. The, the volume here is increasing. That's probably because of the MEX launch. You see that? So you have a, you have a good volume now on MEX. This to me looks like an accumulation range, right? And this probably will continue for a while. Probably. You have to bear in mind that the, va the point of control is in the highs according to dex guru and this is on the total range going back to 19th of december uh if this wants to go up it has to flip that point of control into support or the point of control needs to chain move down lower to a lower level because there's more volume at the lows yeah but you do have a level here at 0 0.145 you just got to bear in mind that a lot the original investors are sitting in a lot of profit right now because they the token supply the tokens they got were at launch price which according to this is really low um basically zero i don't know it doesn't really say what does it say the all-time low is here i'll put it here Pace isn't working. It's annoying. 
0 0.09713. Yeah, look, that's your all-time low, yeah? So just bear that in mind. I don't know what this wick is. It'd be nice to catch this, get this price of the lows. Like, I think if you want to accumulate this, just accumulate at the lows, yeah? Just buy the lows. And I think uh, a healthy... A healthy consolidation range is going to form and then you can see what happens you know just see where the volume i think this might consolidate for a while like it's only just launched on this exchange it's very possible this this carries on for a few months to be honest with you uh, and then once they start picking up interest and people start speculating i think once you have a long consolidation period It'll be a lot easier to trade because it's it looks like it's quite new. What's the all time high? So I'll tell you where I would be interested in picking up this token. One sixteen is here. I'll show you. Sixteen. So actually, the all time high is much higher. It's here. Just type that in. That's the all time high. So just be careful because the chart on MEX doesn't show it correctly. And then if you do a FIB uh, retracement from the low to the high. Yeah, so there you go. Basically, this. So that you could, what you could think about is. Let's go down SFP this low. Um, and then technically a trade, that would be your trade on an SFP of that low into the golden pocket. That's a technical trade. And you trade that back up to potentially the all-time high, but actually you have to clear this resistance at this previous range so you'd have to potentially you take the SFP if you want to trade this somehow go down SFP and then your target will be the value area low that's your trade you take the SFP as the price comes above that previous level you'd enter you have a small invalidation that's your trade and that could be Defer, that could be the significant low for the rest of this bull market. That could be, you never know, you know. So you, you'd obviously take your profit and you'd have a, have a runner on that trade. Or if you're just accumulating, then every time you take, you, you, you hit a, a new low or a low like that, then you just add some more and you just accumulate. Yeah, and obviously we don't know if that is going to happen. This might go down again. It could, it, could, it could keep on doing that, you know. It could just keep on making new lows until you change the trend and start going up. Uh, is the trend up or down? No, at the moment the trend is sideways, but the, there is going to be a trend forming soon in the on the local level, and you have to see how that plays out. I don't know if this is going to happen, but that would be your, your first trade, and that's the trade that I'd be interested in. All right. I hope that helps. Um, remind me and I'll have a look at it again in a, in, a, in a few months time for you. But I don't think there's anything else to say. Looks like a healthy project. It's a DEX. I like DEXs. They will always do well. All right. I hope everyone's had fun and I've had fun with everyone. So have a wonderful Sunday and take care the one concurrent viewer watching. <laughs>